Lee Sterling of ParamountSports.com, and today I'm going to break down what should be a great game on Friday night. It's a battle in the Pac-12 between the Utah Running Utes and the USC Trojans. Now, before I break down and predict this game, I want to let you know what's going on at Paramount Sports. Well, we continue to roll. We dominated over the weekend. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, 10-2, and two, and we hit our huge 45-unit play, huge on UCF. They dominated Stanford. So you want to come on board. We've won the last two weeks and it hadn't even been close. This is what we have in store for you. You can get the rest of the season through the Super Bowl, 897. That gets you every college game in the regular season, NFL regular season, over 40 college bowl games, NFL playoffs, and Super Bowl. Everything. That's my executive phone service, 897. Or how about this? You've never tried me before. You've been with someone else, you're losing, or it's not going well on your own. 197 with coupon code SAVE200. It's my September special from now through Monday, October 3rd. Just 197 with coupon code SAVE200 or use that coupon code SAVE400, 897 for the entire season and start winning. ParamountSports.com or 800-400-9741. Now onto this game on Friday night between Utah laying three to three and a half at USC. So you look at USC and you say, wow, two and one came so close to beating BYU on the road. But their wins are over Fresno State and Stanford, who were mere shells of their team from last year. Neither team, to be honest with you, I think they're going to have 500 records, maybe a little more than that, but they're not great. They're not close to their opponent here, which is the Utah running Utes. Utah dominated last year's game. The final was 41 to 28, but they had a 541 to 205 total yard advantage. Lots of three and outs for the USC offense. Now you bring in an experienced team and a defense, which might be the best in the country in Utah against a quarterback for USC. Only second start ever. So he played well for some parts of the game last week against BYU, but still threw three interceptions. Last year, they only ran USC in this game for 2.4 yards per carry against Utah. So if they can't run, this kid's going to throw a couple more interceptions here. Too much pressure on this kid, Caden Slovis. Utah, <laughs> I think they're going to probably lose somewhere down the road to Washington or Washington State on the road, but it's not going to be this Friday night. Utah wins by double digits, 31 to 20. You want to hop on board and start winning? No one in the country comes close to my record. You go to ParamountSports.com or call 800-400-9741.